Hi guys, so today we have a full case of the Tokidoki Zodiac Unicornos. This is a set of 12, and there is no chaser, so I'm thinking we should get a full set. Now I did pick this up at Five Below. They're some of the more affordable Tokidokis if you can't get them on a good clearance deal. And I have opened up, I think, two or three of these in the past because I did get them on clearance. And I think I got Capricorn, Cancer, Aquarius, and Pisces. I really like the Gemini. I'm curious if you get both of them or it's like one of them. Um, I really want Sagittarius because my husband's a Sagittarius and I think that the Aries, Leo, and Taurus look phenomenal. So here is the set in all of its glory. So we're going to kind of rip through these. There's not really too much like excitement I guess because they don't have um like a chance for a chase or anything also these are the ones that come with the little sticker sheets I love the sticker sheets I think they are so cute I love throwing these in my Mercari orders and the stickers are so small and adorable that you could sneak them onto like anything so that is a awesome little bonus but here is the sticker sheet and it has one of every single option we have our little booklet here per usual which has the set what unicornos are and what tokidoki means in every single box let's see what our first little tokidoki is are you kidding me we got gemini and we got the peach one which is so adorable i can't believe that we pulled gemini on the first one honestly i would want both gemini's but this one is so adorable it's metallic super cute we got this really cute little doodle of the two bears there so adorable there's like a gem on her necklace she's wearing the crown that has the gemini symbol as well as on this side so starting off strong we got gemini Let's see who else we get i think that was the only like mystery one like truly oh we got pisces which is my zodiac sign um i don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing to some people i don't think people are really surprised whenever i tell them what my zodiac sign is i don't have anybody like disgusted or anything if they ask and i tell them they're like yeah you know so i guess it makes sense but super cute this one is like the glitter a lot of these are the glitter ones so i was kind of shocked that that one was more metallic-y but I absolutely love this one. So cute. I already have this one. So that one might end up on my Mercari. If anybody's interested, I usually sell my duplicates on there. Or I make lots, you know. I get these at a decent price. I like to try and sell them that way unless they are more valuable. This is so sick. And this one wasn't even on my radar. This is Scorpio. This one is so awesome. The first one being the big earrings of the symbol. So sick. Love the artwork on like the eye. It's so like a dark wine color. It has the little spiky cuffs around the hooves. The tail is supposed to mimic a scorpion tail. Is like a 10 out of 10. So far my favorite one. <laughs> Wasn't even on my radar but that one was really sick. We got Sagittarius. Oh my gosh, and the wings are flock. Wow, okay, so here is Sagittarius. This one does not have a gem. Anyway, here is Sagittarius. Super, super cute. Love this one, the little flocked wings. Okay, Let's see, I really want to see Aries or Taurus. If we could get those, or Leo. Those are still ones that I definitely wanted to see. <gasps> we got Cancer, but here is the Cancer one. And it is pretty cute. I do really like it. Um, but it just, the only thing I wish is that it had some more depth. Like these at least break it up and they aren't all glittery. Um, but this is the first one where I think it's pretty much like a full glitter. Okay. See who we get. 
give me the sticker, please. <gasps> you guys, we got the Taurus one! And it has a little red, like, cape on it, which is so fun. And it is also flocked, so I really love that element. So here is Taurus with the red flocked little cape, you know, because it's a bull. Super, super well done on this one. I think this one is probably one of my favorites. So far it's this one and Scorpio. I think Aries is going to be cute. Maybe like the whole entire bottom of Aries is flocked since it looks like it's solid. Oh, I forgot this one. So this one is the Libra, which I have also had and opened, and it is split like 50-50, so it is almost two separate figures. And on the box, you only see it from this side, so you would never know unless you actually pulled the figure. So this is the side that you don't see when looking at the packaging or the box. It is purple, and it has some different elements on it, um, like the little black cuffing around near the hooves. And then on this side, it is the white cuffing, very similar kind of like art and patterns. Up here, you have white on one side and black on the other. We are over halfway through this box now. I still need Aries and I still need Leo. I still need Virgo and Capricorn. Here is Leo. This is one that I think that they should have um, made the main flocked because it's a lion and with the other little flock details, I think that would have looked super, super cool. This one has like the lion mane and then there's also a lion in the crown. It is really, really glittery and super, super cool. There's little whisker details. There's some really fine like fur detailing. I don't know if it's going to pick up on camera, but there's some really fine fur detailing there. Really cute. I do like that one. I don't love it as much as I was hoping to, but I want the Aries. Give me Aries. Let's see. Aries. No! We got the Virgo one, which is super dainty, but it does have some nice little elements to it. I love the little flowers and the little hearts and stars printed on the wings and I love the little pink and purple combo. This one's really cute. My mom is a Virgo. Super super cute. I love the hair on here. It's it's very much giving um the girl from Hercules. I can't remember what her name is like the Disney movie. Very much like a Greek goddess-esque and I love the little flower detailing down there as well. I need Aquarius, Aries, and Capricorn. This one feels heavy, so I'm thinking this might be Aries, which would be super exciting. <gasps> it is, and it is blue! I love this one. This one is really awesome. You have these beautiful, like, bronzy uh, antlers. The gem stone looks like it has like some like markings on it. It is all raised up and fluffy like a ram or a sheep would be. The mane is actually where the transparent glitter comes in. Super super cool. I love it. And then they are dipped in like the little copper as well. So cute. Definitely a favorite. Okay, we are only missing Capricorn and Aquarius, which I have opened in other videos. So, here we go. We have the Capricorn one. I do like the horns on this one, and then it's supposed to be like a little goat. I almost wish that they weren't like unicornos and they actually like were the zodiac little doodles that they have on them because I think that those would look so cool. And it is like white into this blue with the little tail. And it is really, really cute. There's the necklace. And this last one should be Aquarius because 
That's the only one that we're missing. We'll be crazy if we got both of the Geminis, but it is Aquarius. I love the tail on this one because it looks like water. It's Aquarius, this very deep blue, but you can see the detailing in the tail. I love the little vase on the back. The crown, which is also like a vase and it's spilling out water. There's a lot of detail on this figure. Let me know in the comments down below if you think that your sign was beautifully represented or not, um, or which one was your favorite in terms of design. Um, I think my favorite one, oh my gosh, I don't know if I could really pick. I still love the Scorpio one, the Aries one, and the Taurus one. <sighs> It might be the Scorpio, you guys. It might be the Scorpio is my favorite. Okay, anyway, I love you guys. Thank you so much for watching. I will see you again very, very soon. Peace out, Girl Scouts.